you, Roman? I am good, Javier. Nice to see you again. I, I don't remember the last time uh, I saw you, but definitely wasn't this cold. <laughs> no, it wasn't this cold. I think we were in It's uh, minus five uh, Celsius, so it's around... 300 15. below zero. Exactly. I'm, that's yeah. what I'm going with, because I can't it's, do the conversion. It's cold, <laughs> but it's fun. Uh, we're here with Volkswagen, trying the, all the models that have the four motion uh, uh, all-wheel drive system, which is the fifth generation of the four motion. So uh, we're in the wagon, the all track. And this car is actually more fun uh, uh, here because it like turns around much more. Yeah, like there's, no of... there's no weight in the back. Right? Here we go. Now we did the out across section of it. Now oh, no. now we're doing the. Don't kill a cone, Javier. Don't kill Truck. a cone. So obviously, Roman, you live in Colorado. You have much more experience than me. Who live? I live in Miami. So. Tell us some tips about driving in these conditions. You know, you have to have, if you want serious tips, you want to have a lot more stopping distance <laughs> because you can run into things like, 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 like burns and cones. <laughs> so you want to leave yourself a lot more room. You always want to look not at what you're aiming for because you will drive at what you're aiming for, but ahead. So not look here, but look, look there. Yeah, look where Almost you're going. To the side window, right? Sometimes? Yeah. yeah, the biggest tip I can give you is you will always go where you're looking. So if you're looking at that cone, you will hit that cone. So look beyond it, look into the next turn. Uh, and then, you know, use your throttle to control the car. Not much of the brakes. brakes. Yeah, yeah. That's and that's because if you hit the brakes, you're going to slide. Even with ABS, yeah, you're going to slide yeah. a little bit. So I think if you um, take those tips and don't hit any wolves or bears. <laughs> I don't see any, so I, don't, I think we're safe with that. You are good to go, my man. Yeah. Then, then when I come to Miami, you can show me how to like, go power boating. <laughs> okay, well, that would be cool. So what do you think about this strategy that uh, Volkswagen is finally putting uh, the four motion system in almost all the cars? They don't have it in the Passat the Jetta, which is the most popular cars in their brands, but they have it in the Atlas, in the T1, the old track and the Golf car. And the new Artrian or Atrian? Oh, Artrian, yeah. yeah. I don't know how it's coming, it. coming in, yeah. Yeah, I think it's uh, about time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, all wheel drive has become synonymous with in some ways luxury and high performance and if you want to sell even a semi luxurious high performance car it needs to have all wheel drive and also uh like four wheel drive cars have been very very popular in states like colorado up here like not in, well in canada obviously too but right. like but not in miami the Nordic, not in miami and most people associate that with the winter or like off-roading but there it has other other benefits right? yeah sure like in the rain it's wonderful you have better traction in the rain uh, it gives you kind of a sure-footed peace of mind confidence that no matter what the weather you're able to basically drive wherever you're going and you know I just drove because we were in the Chicago Auto Show I just drove back because of the snowstorm and a front wheel oh, drive yeah. fusion it was terrifying terrifying oh really oh yeah summer tires fusion oh terrifying. Well, the tires make a big difference yeah the tires make a big so difference. Roman since you are the more experienced guy why don't we switch and you drive and you teach me how to do it yeah sure I'll try not to kill the cone <laughs> I'm a little taller than you are, Javier. Just a few, just a, a few, few inches. inches, yeah. And I, I drive the, the steering wheel really low. Yeah, too. yeah, there we go. Um, yeah, I mean, this is a really fun car because even though um, it still has a little bit of traction control, it never completely disables it. It does give you the ability to drive it with a throttle. So right now, I'm just using the back end of the car to bring it around, and just gentle inputs, right? You don't want to do anything uh, too abrupt. So very, very gentle inputs, constant throttle, you use the traction that you have, bring the back end around over here, look past the corner where you're going. And, oh, then uh, you missed it too. I don't think that bad. <laughs> sometimes you miss it. Yeah. But it was I mean, that's the thing. You cannot, you can be so careful and still yeah. have some problems with, with these conditions, right? Yeah, but you know, like any race car, being smooth is always key, right? Yeah. So the more abrupt you are, the worse you're going to get. I'd like to do this at full throttle and just go crazy with it. I don't think they will let us do it. No. Here, now it's full throttle. <laughs> well, Roman, thank you very much. Thank you, Javier. Dude, that was I'll, fun, man. I'll, I'll wait for you in Miami then and we go no, power, power boating. boating. Yeah. 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 Excellent. Yeah.